Good morning. I'm Mrs. McElhaney, and I teach the broadcasting program here at John Marshall High School. We are located on the first floor in room 117. The live production you're about to see was produced by WJMH students. Joining me now live in the studio is WJMH senior Chris Evans. The broadcasting program here at JM aims to teach students communication skills, time management, and proper work ethic. A normal week for WJMH Media Juniors consists of learning the fundamentals of broadcasting, recording announcements, and preparing for various remote events. As seniors, we work on writing scripts, gathering video, and editing stories, which results in a weekly news show that broadcasts daily on our YouTube page, topperstation.com and Xfinity Channel 14. Now, let's check in with Maria Evans, who is here to show you around our workplace. Thanks, Chris. This is our control room where most of the behind the scene work happens. Typically, we don't have a camera back here, but today my coworker Richard wants to show you what exactly goes on in our control room. This is WJMH senior Clara. She is working as our audio technician. She's making sure that everything you hear right now sounds crystal clear. Watching over Clara is our director Haley. Haley's job is to call all the shots, making sure the correct elements make it on air. Then our technical director Tristan listens to her and puts them on air. In order to display the different elements, she works the switcher and TriCaster. When she presses one of those big, bright buttons, she's changing what you are seeing in real time. Now I'll introduce you to Hannah and Alex. Alex is running Master Control. The Master Control operator is important for timing our shows and counting the director in and out of commercial breaks. Hannah is running our teleprompter, which is in charge of scrolling through the script I'm reading right now. It is important that she pay attention to what I'm saying. She doesn't move too fast or too slow. The script she's scrolling through was written in our newsroom. Our newsroom is right next to our studio. It's where all of our ideas are first thrown out, then turned into stories. After the writing process is complete, we're able to sign out cameras, gather video, and edit them using Adobe Premiere. The newsroom is at the very beginning of all of our projects, and that's the basics of our jobs here at WJMH Media. Thanks, Maria. Not only does the broadcasting program produce a show every week, we also go out into the field to cover remote events. Football season is one of our busiest times because it's our job to broadcast each home game on our YouTube page. We also cover Dancing with the Ohio Valley Stars, the Marshall County Chamber of Commerce Christmas Parade, Monarch Tidings, and many Wheeling Symphony Orchestra events. This year, we also partnered with the Ohio Valley Athletic Conference. With this, our students in grades 9 through 12 work both behind the scenes and on air to broadcast many OVAC championships, starting with OVAC Wrestling in January, which aired live on WTRF.com. Our crew went back to West Banco Arena in February to record the OVAC Cheerleading Championships. While this was not broadcasted live, the recording is available on WTRF.com. Finally, we attended the OVAC Basketball Championships at Harrison Central High School. During this event, our students broadcasted five championship games live on WTRF.com. We are very excited to continue to work with the OVAC and many organizations in the future. Not only do we work hard here at WJMH, but we also have a lot of fun. Let's send it back to Mrs. McLehaney for more information. Thanks, Chris. Again, if you would like to visit our studio, you can do so on the first floor in room 117. You can also contact me via email at carly.mcelhaney at k12.wv.us. Thanks for watching. Have a great day, Monarchs.